The countdown continues with four days left until the 2011 Minnesota Fishing Opener. Our coverage continues in Brainerd, where Tim Ettinger from the SNW Guide Service says it's definitely going to be a tough opener on Gall Lake. Of course, last year the big story was the early spring. It was warm. This year it's been cold and late. Do you think the cold weather has really affected the walleye pattern here on Gall? I would say, judging from the way the panfish have been biting, that things are behind schedule away is a good week or so. The water temps are down, um, maybe uh, eight, nine degrees. Uh, colder than they typically are uh, for an opener. Where should people really be looking? Should they look all over the lake or do you think certain parts might be pretty hot? I think wherever there's an inlet, wherever there's moving water coming into a body of water, uh, structures associated with that inlet, shallow flats, and I think this year we might find fish scattered up in the very shallow water. We're talking four or five feet of water and hanging out in those waters uh, throughout the day, uh, weather permitting. And of course the big thing on Gull Lake is the zebra mussels. How much are the guides really trying to get the message out about people trying to check their boats mm -hmm. and, how, and how much do you really want to stress that this weekend? Oh, I tell you what, uh, being aware of the situation going on with invasive species in our area is absolutely critical. Um, we need everybody draining all that water from their boat before they leave the landing. We need everybody checking uh, the trailers and the bunks for weeds and so on and so forth. Um, we're not going to be able to stop invasive species, but if we can do what we can to slow the spread, that's going to be the key feature. Very well said, Tim. Just a reminder, be sure to check your boats for any weeds and make sure to drain your live wells so that everybody can have a great day on opener. Look at that guy water skiing right there. And we want to remind anglers to send in pictures this fishing season for our new segment, What a Catch. You can send your pictures to sports at lptv.org. Include your name, the type of fish, how many pounds, and the lake you were on. The segment will air every Monday starting next week, and it's going to be exciting to see some big fish this summer.